Tejumoladi Nuga host art exhibition. Tejumoladi Nuga hosted his inaugural solo exhibition titled Future Past at Art 21 Gallery, New Hotel and Suite, Victoria Island, Lagos. Known as Butler Archive, Adi Nuga is not only an artist but a designer of furniture and lighting as well. At 29, he has rapidly gained prominence within the Nigerian creative diaspora community in the UK. His work gained global recognition through pointless portraits of notable figures like the late Chadwick Boseman and Lee Alexander McQueen. Speaking on the importance of art in life and society, According to the founder of Art 21 Gallery, Ms. Kaleen Chagri Mudaba, one of the reasons why art is so essential is the inherent intimacy in being able to access another's life, which in some way allows us access to ours. When we come into art, we're exchanging in a state of vulnerability that sometimes we're unfamiliar with. We become interdependent with a story, even when we don't realize it. The renowned art connoisseur describes the exhibition thus, Future Past explores the past, present, and future from the perspective of a child who grew up near the river, surrounded by artisans who flourished with an elegance that transcended the mundane. It takes the viewer through an evoked sense of time and place, where time is both real and fictional, and the place is the same too. In an interview with Heap TV, Adinuga discusses the inspiration behind his pieces, drawn from portraits of his friends, which he often uses as references. He assigns them titles of noble men within his fictional society, paying homage to his friendships, community and birthplace that nurtured his creativity. Each character in his artwork serves a distinct role in the society he has constructed. The artist notes the effort of peers in the arts community in building successful careers despite challenges of profitability. He also spoke on the unique challenges Nigeria-based artists face. Notable guests in attendance at the exhibition included Danny Kipogokoglu, General Manager of a Hotel in Suites, Iaduni Bedebo, Director of Sales and Marketing, Assistant Brand Manager, amongst others. The event was elevated by performances from cultural dramas, infusing the atmosphere with a distinct ambience. Super talented artist. I don't even have to tell him anything. He's good all on his own, but just wishing him the best of luck. Um, as you can see, the work is really detailed. It takes a lot of time. You know, it's not easy to come up with this kind of stuff. So um, I wish him all the best for all the hard work that he's put in. And uh, it's just really nice to experience such clean and crisp work, so to speak. Oh, and also there's the balloon pit that is amazing. I went in there and I was jumping like a child. It was only me and this like three-year-old girl and my sister was great. But um, these are the kinds of expressions that you want uh, with art for it to be multifaceted and to touch you in some way and all of the artwork is doing that so hi my name is Iyaduni uh, this is one of the most phenomenal exhibitions I've ever been to I think in terms of the artist the, the, the talent here the artistry has just been amazing I think that each piece is a representation of a lot of depth and artistry. I think that the space that is being exhibited is beautiful and I give kudos to the owners of this space because to be honest with you, when artists have a platform to express themselves, there is nothing more rewarding than putting all this hard work into a, a piece of art and give, being given a platform where you can showcase and express all of this beautiful work and that's what I appreciate the most about this this exhibition today. My name is Tetramala Adenoga. I'm an artist and designer based in London, but I grew up in Ijebode, Ogun State. So this show is mostly taking the place I grew up in, which is Imoro Road in Ijebode, and putting it within a fictional context. I'm telling the story about the noblemen, the artisans that operate within, within this fictional story and how their stories look like. So this these uh, portraits are mostly like reflections of my friends. I take a lot of, I'm like, hey, can I have a photo? Can I use a reference within my work? Um, and I'm giving them titles of like these noble men that control certain aspects in this fictional society. And I think that what that does is I am giving a note to my friendship and my community, but I'm also referencing the place where I was born and the place that birthed my creativity. So, 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 so this guy is a philosopher he kind of runs the, the what do you call it, the non tangible part of the society. He writes poems, he writes laws, he writes dreams, he introduces new ideas into the society to be executed by other people. So each of these characters have a part to play. For example, those are divinity sisters, they work with the oracle to predict the future of the society. Her, she's the director of joy. 
and she runs the kind of events program and makes sure that everyone is actually having fun.